Do you want a box full of wrestling merchandise delivered to you every month? Check out WrestleCrate in the description and use discount code TOMSENTME for a cheeky 10% off. Alright guys, Tom here and welcome to a new video. This is the 28th day in a row I have uploaded a video. How good is that? But today we've got some amazing, shocking backstage news about the changes to the Royal Rumble ending on Sunday. And we've also got the original plans revealed and why the reason was that they changed it last minute. So according to Inquisitor, having Ambrose and Triple H in the final two was not the original plan and WWE changed it after Reigns entered the arena and was booed by the WWE universe. So according to this, they changed it with about half an hour to go. So Reigns during the match was taken out by the League of Nations halfway through and was taken to the back apparently to reassess the finish to the Royal Rumble match. Now it's being said that Triple H was always meant to win but the decision was made to eliminate Reigns second to last and leave Ambrose in the final two because WWE didn't want the crowd turning on Reigns and cheering for Triple H at the end of the match. So WWE knew that Ambrose would have the underdog sympathy from the universe, enough for Triple H to gain some heel heat by becoming the WWE champion when he eliminated Dean Ambrose in the finish. Apparently, they were scared if when it came down to Roman against Triple H in the final two, that the universe would end up booing Roman Reigns and cheering Triple H, and that's not what they wanted. They wanted Triple H to get booed, and by having Dean Ambrose there instead of Reigns, they knew the crowd would cheer Dean Ambrose, and they would boo Triple H. So apparently they changed this whilst Roman Reigns was backstage, apparently being treated. So that is absolutely shocking. They changed it with about half an hour to go. But it is revealed that the plan was always to have Triple H win, but it's kind of crazy that they only changed it last minute, and due to his crowd reaction, they were kind of forced to do it. So what do you guys think about this shocking backstage news? The source will be in the description. I hope you have in fact enjoyed this video. Follow me on Twitter and Facebook. Also check out the video which is going to show in a minute. Take care, spike your hair. Alright guys, Tom here and welcome to a new video. If you guys could smash the likes, that'd be absolutely brilliant. Today, we are doing top 10 WWE Royal Rumble winners. If you guys could do me a favour and check out two other videos I have up on my channel. One is 10 superstars John Cena has buried and the other one is top 10 WWE money in the bank cash-ins. Let's get into this guys with the top 10 Royal Rumble winners winners. Number 10 is Alberto Del Rio at the Royal Rumble 2011. 